morning everybody welcome to another day of vlogtober i'm in the car it is so cold outside this morning the car is only registering at 34 degrees fahrenheit it is it is 7 21 in the morning and i am making my way to work hallelujah we are back to school and i couldn't be more happy or excited to be getting back into a routine uh, last week after the hurricane it was it was intense but thankfully we are back to a schedule i have a much shorter drive this year so that's a blessing i have my coffee that i made i had eggs avocado on a half of a bagel for breakfast i typically have it on ezekiel toast but i didn't have any ezekiel bread forgot i had thrown that away with some of the freezer things after the hurricane so i have to pick up a loaf of that um maddie has danced today so i'll be leaving school pretty early and heading to get her to take home to grab a snack and grab Cooper because I usually will take him for a walk around where the dance studio is since it's only a 45 minute class. But I better get on the road. There's frost on the car. Um, so yeah, that's fun. I'll have to start leaving a little bit earlier. Um, I, I usually leave before this, but getting back into the swing of things was a little rushed this morning. So I'm gonna have to get up a tad bit earlier. I got up at 540. I set my alarm for 5.30, but I think I'm gonna start trying to get up at five o'clock again and getting ready. Luckily, I do shower the evening before, so that helps a lot. But again, welcome to another day of October. Um, yesterday would have been a tidy, tidy video, so we're back to daily vlogging again, which is great, though tomorrow for you, which is Thursday, is a pre-scheduled decluttering video, so definitely check that out when it's up tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> and then the rest of the uh, weekend will be daily vlogs until Tuesday, which will be another tiny tidy. So thanks for being here and let's get this day started. What a day. Oh my goodness. I just finished school. It is three o'clock. Um, Maddie has danced, so I have to run and go and grab her. Um, it's really warm out now and it's only 56 degrees according to the car, but it's pretty it's pretty warm so I'm going to listen to some Joshua Becker and drive to get her and then we're going to run by the house let her grab a snack grab Cooper and I'm going to take him for a walk I'm going to change obviously first because I'm wearing heel booties but um and then we're going to drop her off at the studio walk around the area where she's at for 45 minutes because her class is only that long and then we're going to have takeout tonight for dinner i promised the kids they could have dairy queen matt has basketball so it's me solo parenting for the evening and i have a lot of school work that i have to do um i have to prep some centers for different activities for tomorrow i have an in-service well, redo recovery training, so I am not in the classroom tomorrow, so I have a few things I have to get ready for my substitute, I have to print off my plan, and I want to kind of get ahead of the game and get a few things for the next few weeks already printed and prepped, so I don't have to think about it um, on the weekend. So let's start driving home, and I have an apple. I haven't had an apple. Oh, I haven't had apples in a while, but I'm going to try to eat it because I'm starving. So I'm going to eat my apple and drive home. It is so beautiful out right now. Um, oh, actually, I should grab a jacket before because where her dances is near water. And there might be a little bit of a breeze. So um, the sun is shining and we're just heading out to drop her off and go for a walk.
Okay, we are back from dance and our walk and the kids got Dairy Queen. I didn't pick it up. I didn't feel like all the heaviness, but I'm going to, I have a pot in the stove. I'm going to make a quick, easy chicken noodle soup. Well, actually chicken and stars. We have these like, these little star pastas. So I'm going to, I'm going to use though that in the soup very very quick um i don't have a lot of the things on hand but matt cooked chicken last night so i'm going to use that the stars um some carrots some corn some i think we have peas carrots peas corn that's pretty much it maybe some bread and green pepper and chicken and just using a box broth it's not a like from scratch soup but it's better than like a canned soup. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to maybe make some biscuits. I think we have a, um, I have a red lobster, uh, biscuit mix that I'm going to use. So I'm going, I think I was going to make homemade bread, but it's already six o'clock and I have some school stuff I need to do. And, uh, I want to edit this vlog or at least start it so it can be, uh, easier to edit it tomorrow and yeah that's kind of where we are right now for this evening so um maddie at the box it's just this these are really good um not as good as homemade definitely not but i'm gonna make these biscuits and make the soup and then i'll have some of i might have the soup for dinner tonight but i also have this is the life of quick and easy I have these five minute microwavable mini potatoes that are to die for. They're delicious. So I might have those and a piece of chicken for tonight and then save the soup for lunches this week. But I'll have a biscuit tonight for sure. <laughs> Okay, so I decided to have the potatoes and a piece of chicken. I'm going to pop you up here. Um, I'm just going to have the soup for lunches and um, the kids will have it for lunches as well. But I do have leftovers of the potatoes. So I didn't use all of them. So I'm just having those with chicken. So there it is, just the chicken breast that Matt cooked and some of those mini potatoes. They are delicious and so easy. Five minutes in the microwave and they are cooked to perfection. So I'm gonna eat that and then Connor is tutoring. Seven o'clock, so it's 6.30. I have to print off a few things for school and my lesson plan. And then I think I might actually watch um, something on TV tonight. I've, I was watching a while back when calls when calls of the heart and I stopped and I feel like watching it again so I'm gonna think I was on season four or season five so I'm gonna pick that show up again and continue watching So this uh, schoolwork is taking a lot longer than I anticipated. Ooh, and I forgot about my soup. So here's the soup. Looks really good. So that will be good. I didn't make the biscuits. That should be good for um, lunches this week. My schoolwork is taking a lot longer than I anticipated. Um, I'm kind of really trying to get ahead of myself so I don't have to worry about it in the upcoming weeks. It's a lot of the same repetitive things. Anyway, I'm not gonna bore you with primary curriculum, but um, 
so I'm just getting the things that I know I'll need to do for the next few weeks already prepped and then I don't have to worry about them. I'll be able to just grab and go. Oh, Cooper, what in the world are you doing? I don't know if I showed this boy today, except for our walk when we went on our walk. And there's Mr. Coop Man. He is playing with his ball that we found under the seat of the car. So he is getting quite big. If you've been following me since we got him as a puppy. Anyway, so he's a pretty good boy. Mm, say hi, Cooper. In any case, I don't think I said what time I was. It's 8 o'clock and I feel like I'm all over the place here in this vlog, but that's Vlogtober for you. These things happen and um, the lighting is really bad. <laughs> oh, um, yeah, it's 5, 5. Oh my gosh, I am tired, y'all. It is 7.56. Um, I am going to close up this vlog right now because I don't think I'm doing anything else besides making a cup of tea, having a few cookies, and going to bed. So thanks for watching. Thanks for following me along in Vlogtober. I'm enjoying sharing with you all tomorrow. Well, actually this would be yesterday's, I believe, because you're seeing this on Wednesday. So tomorrow's video for you is a Thursday video and it is a decluttering one. So definitely hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and the bell notification so you don't miss that video. It's a good one. And we will see you again tomorrow and then back on Friday for another daily vlog. So enjoying Vlogtober, I hope you are. Give it a thumbs up if you are. Give me a comment down below. I love hearing from each and every one of you. And take care, stay safe, and have a wonderful evening. Night, everyone. Bye now.